audience here loves her. She reminds me of a ballet dancer. She really has a feel for the music. Five, six and a half, 104 pounds, very tall, almost too thin. She uses it to her advantage, the long legs and long arms. She has a great turning ability. All her turns are performed high on the toe. Beautiful catch in a back scale, showing that flexibility. this back scale and she receives a 9.95 and a 180 degree split there to conclude that performance her total is 19.80 and now we are ready for a gymnast from the Soviet Union Galina Belaglazova her preliminary score you can see is a 10 so we're in for a real treat Belaglazova is 19 years old she too is 5 feet 6 inches tall and began this sport at age 7 and in our all-around coverage yesterday you saw her finish third in the standings she is also a crowd favorite here On the floor, it's a superior, difficult move. She is truly as one with the ball. It's it's almost like it's part of her. This is her strength. The, the ball seems so magnetic. Galina Beloglazova. Now this part I thought was particularly beautiful. It's as if the ball is glued to her body. She has the innate ability to strike beautiful poses throughout this routine. Everything she does is beautiful. Remember, her preliminary score was 10. Today, she receives another 10 to give her a combined Tatiana total of 20. She is our leader, which puts the pressure on Tatiana Druchinina, the all-around champion, who also has a preliminary score of 10. She'll need another to get a goal. Druchinina is definitely an all-around performer. All of her events are excellent. But this event in particular is her most theatrical of all. That was a pre-acrobatic element. The gymnast is allowed to perform three of those in the routine. If she does more than three, it's a deduction of five-tenths. Now, pre-acrobatic skill is one that does not pass through the vertical, as you see in artistic gymnastics. Why do they not want the gymnast to tumble and do the full twists and the round-off flip-flops and things like that? Because this is a completely different sport than artistic, and they don't want it going in that direction. They want to emphasize use with the apparatus, 
Beauty and elegance, and not the tricks. Another high toss. It's so tempting to watch the apparatus go up in the air, but the true difficulty is what the gymnast does as the ball is up in the air. Look how expressive she is. It's as though she's telling a story. Routine by Tatiana Duchinina. She brought in a preliminary score of 10 and receives yet another 10 to give her a perfect total of 20. So we have a two-way tie for first with Filipova taking third. We now have for you a young lady from East Germany, Esther Nicholas, who does a very clever routine. Now, we saw her in the preliminaries. You saw her preliminary score last night, 9.8. She's going to do the same routine again, and I love this leotard with the little black bow tie. I really do, too. I enjoyed this last night as well. She has great expression in this routine. feel for the music. Putting on the Ritz. This routine doesn't have as much difficulty as some of the other routines, but it really makes up for it in choreography. It truly shows that you can have fun in this sport. I think if you're ambidextrous, it helps. I think it's a prerequisite in this sport to be ambidextrous. There's a double side roll in the toss. Another superior element. Oh, cute routine. <laughs> Unfortunately, her preliminary score will probably keep her out of the medal count, but it was such a clever routine, the crowd loves it. Her preliminary score, again, was 9.8, and she receives, for this performance, a 9.85 to give her a 19.65 total. And now to a more serious note, USSR's Marina Lobach. We're going to see a completely different side of this gymnast. This routine's very playful. superior difficulties. She receives another 10 to give her a combined total of 20 and the lead. And now it is time for our next competitor. She is from Bulgaria. Her name is Svetomira Filipova, who brings in a preliminary score of 9.85. She trains at Lievki Sparta. Now, this is her second appearance in the individual event finals. We saw her in the ball competition earlier. This routine is a very dramatic routine. 
She has a wide variety of different emotions and expressions that she shows. It's a very difficult routine. Watch the tosses. High in the air. Catches on the floor in the back arch. And then picks up with the drama of the routine. They must keep the clubs moving at all times. She's meeting all of the requirements. Performance by 17 year old Setomira Filipova. Again, her preliminary score was 9.85. We'll add to that the 10 for a 19.85 total. So let's take a look at the final standings. A perfect score of 20 for Marina Lobach gives her the gold. Filipova will take the bronze. <laughs>